Hello everyone. Welcome. How's it going? <coughs> My name is Ian Higton. Uh, I have a croaky karaoke voice and uh, I'm going to be playing Hatred and Z1 for you for a little bit. Um, I'm very discombobulated because I think I'm still a little bit hungover. From, actually, I know I'm very hungover from my wedding. Um, I've already forgotten to plug my headphones in, so that's a good start. <laughs> so uh, before I do that, let's announce some competition winners, shall we? Because I did a competition last H1Z1 stream, asking you lovely Viewingtons whether or not uh, you wanted to win some deluxe Founders Pack codes. <clears throat> now, I... Um, the way to do that was to send me a clip on Twitter and to tag it with H1Z1 Moments, hashtag H1Z1 Moments, uh, and then I'd, I'd pick five out of the mountains of entries I received and uh, give out the codes. I have done that, so I will uh, I'll show you, I'm going to show you who is the winners, and, um, and then if you are the winners, if you are one of the winners, um, keep an eye out on your Twitter DMs. Uh, for a DM from Platform32. Hopefully you follow me on, on my Platform32 Twitter account. If you don't, I'll send you a message and say, hey, please follow me. Uh, and yeah, I'll DM you a, uh, a code for a, a, a H1Z1 Deluxe Founders Pack, which normally retails for about £39.99 and gives you a flaming helmet, loads of crates and things. So anyway, hopefully I've done this right. <clears throat> Fingers crossed. Right, so the first winner, and there may be sound for these, I don't know. We'll, I guess I'll find out in a second. First winner is Nobble, or General Nob, for this uh, this amazing uh, uh, match-winning snipe. You see, he's like, where's the guy? Where's the guy he's got to kill? Where is the guy he's got to kill? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Where is he? Oh, wait, there he is, miles away. Shot right in the face. Survived. I'm a big fan of uh, snipe finishes. I, I, I've i done quite a few snipe finishes myself. I'll, I'll have you know. So that's one of the winners. Um, it looked like there was sound. I don't know if it was drowning me out or not, but uh, apologies if it was. Looks like my mic's peaking quite a bit. I don't know, it was quite high. Yeah, but, uh, uh, so, yeah, that was uh, congrats to Noble. So, yes, hello, everyone. Uh, DM, shouldn't it be Sausage M, says Vandal. Oh, it could be. Uh, the next winner was uh, Nico de Powell, who I believe is um, is uh, Astfugl. I get confused because everyone has different different names on everything. It's only 48 seconds long, this one. Triple kill with a sniper rifle. Do, 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 do. I should have fast-forwarded some of them a little bit. Sorry. <clears throat> La la la. There's one. Boff. Boff. There's another. Look at him. Shoot fish in a barrel. Boff. The other one's like lying down. Didn't know what to make of it. Deaded him. Excellent. So that's, that's the code for Asfugul as well. Uh, the next one is uh, Jick Gameplays. Uh, this one, I won't show the whole of this one. But basically, um, he smashed it. 25 kills in one match. Um, I'll show you the last, like... So what's he up to? 24 kills at this point. He had the, uh, uh, the LMG and was just cutting fools down left, right and centre. Um... I, I think I might be a little bit scared of him. Uh, he, he fast forwards it a bit. If you search for Ian Higton and then hashtag H1Z1 moments, you can watch the whole of this. Uh, it's quite quite unbelievable the amount of kills he gets. I think my highest amount of kills in one match is like, like 13. There you go, that's a match winning kill. 25, so Jick Gameplays, he wins one. Uh, Recrudes. Wins one with the uh, sniping with an AR clip. Quite, quite impressive. 
quite hard to snipe with an AR. The ARs are good for like long, long, medium to long range, but not not that great for sniping. 151 meters. This is allegedly. Boff. Didn't couldn't even bloody see him. Couldn't even bloody see him. So uh, yeah, that's uh, recrudesce, and the final goes to Gavin. I'm not going to show the entirety of Gavin's one. Uh, so this is mainly I mainly gave it to Gavin because of the editing. Um, because it's, it's a funny video. Uh, it's got lots lots of little mishaps and mischievousness. Oh, and I also like shooting people on quad bikes. Uh, that's always one of my favourite things to do. So. Poff. So, yeah, well done, everybody. Well done for uh, doing the wins. I will um, DM you with, uh, with your codes uh, after this stream. So, congratulations to you lot. <clears throat> and hello to Off World Us, Fogel Out, Fruit Bat, Callie Warner, Dave Law, Owen Maguire, Icarus Abides, Isabella, Jackie Holmes, Jewel Balls, Kate Lily, Lazy Jane, Nightcat, Nummy Numbers, Castaway DC, Castor, uh, Space Up, Doctor, and Vandal. Welcome. Welcome on, welcome. Oh, we got 92 people watching, so talk amongst yourselves for a second because I forgot my headphones. So yeah, you'll get those codes imminently. And by imminently, I mean like in the next hour or so. I'm probably going to only do about an hour on this because, uh, yeah, as you can tell, I'm I'm, I'm, pretty, I'm just fucked. It's been, it's been a long weekend. There's some heavy drinking. Sunday was an absolute write-off. Um, I've got to go into... What's going on here? I've got to go into Brighton um, in a minute. Oh, for some reason, I, I can't get the picture up on my telly. I've got to go to Brighton tomorrow to do a late to the party. And then on Wednesday, I've got to go to a press event. And then, like, got all the EGX planning and scripts and everything to do. And then on EGX week, it's like a seven day week. It's just going to be crazy. So, two seconds. Why isn't the HDMI cable giving me a picture of my tall burden? Make it so. Oh, do you want to exchange this challenge? No, not really. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Right. Oh, I've got my telly up now. I got my tally up. <laughs> Space Off Cuts is giving me a super chat for painkillers to help ease my wedding hangover. Believe me, I need it. What kind of challenges have we got? Complete one solo match. I think I can do that. Survive until your team wins duos. Absolutely not. Complete five matches. Oh, I can do that. Kill five enemies in the Swagnum Opus arcade matches. What are they? Let's try that out. Arcade. Swagnum Opus. Let's try the Swagnum Opus match, huh? See, I didn't even know. I've, I've been out of the loop. Been too busy getting married. Not been keeping up with the gaming news. So, uh, I have no idea what a Swagnum Opus is. I guess it's going to be a game where mode where you just use the Magnums. But we'll find out. Man with the Golden Gun from Goldeneye, says Owen Maguire. Maybe. Thanks, Steve Scodes. Hope you're well. So, hello to all the uh, the regulars and the moderators. And Nightcat for putting in some more uh, the link to the EGX tickets. Oh, and there's a loot message coming up. I forgot to turn on loot because I'm stupid. Let's find out what it says. These loot ads get longer and then the amount of time the messages are on the screen. It's even short. Congratulations on your wedding. Best wishes to you and Laura. That's from at Fruit Bat. Don't forget at EGX 
the community party uh, on the Saturday, I will be popping along and I'll be wearing the space cat hoodie that uh, that you lot um, kindly clubbed together and bought me. So if you want to see that in the flesh on the Saturday, I will be there. And I'll be there every day of EGX. Uh, probably not drinking every night because I've got busy times, but I'll be streaming and doing uh, from the live stage and uh, doing meet and greets and things with uh, Johnny, Bendix and Aoife uh, all the way through till the Sunday. So that'd be fun, won't it? Hopefully see you there. <clears throat> Thanks to everyone giving me the congratulations on the marriages. Um, it's been so many that I haven't been able to say thank you to everyone individually. Uh, but, ah, there we go. I was, I was like, I don't remember having a green parachute, but there you go. My, uh, my colourful Rastafarian, Rastafarian parachute. My Rasta parachute has uh, has popped open, and we're going down. And we're going to see exactly what this mode's all about very quickly, I think, because uh, oh shit, too many people have landed. Um, oh, I've already got a gun. Oh, you start with a gun, okay. Has someone got a... What the? Oh, okay, that was weird. Uh, not sure what's going on with that. I think I need to Google what this mode is because I had one bullet for that and everyone else seems to be firing fireworks. <laughs> Swagnum opus. What is it? <clears throat> this was... That happened in... It's happened on the PC in 2017, allegedly. All players spawn with a Swagnum, a very powerful sidearm that can one-shot kill to the body, even in armour. Each player starts with a single bullet for it, so make sure your first shot counts. More swagnum can be found in airdrop crates. The number of airdrops that occur during the match has been increased dramatically. Golden beams will call them out. Each crate can contain up to six swagnum rounds. The other new weapon is the crossbow and their firework arrows. These arrows will launch small fireworks when they hit a target. Okay. I would detonate in the air if they don't hit anything. Okay. Ah, it's probably probably a good idea for me to have read that first because I didn't bloody know that you only had one ammo. Swagnum opus. Let's give it another go, huh? Isabella's going to be with us in spirit at EGX. Are you a, is she a ghost? So that's why she's a death clock. <clears throat> yeah, about 15 seconds or so to Isabella. Oh, man. I've eaten so unhealthily recently as well. Uh, I don't find it any different at all, Vicky Warren. No, I do not. Hello, Cats Meow. Cats Meow wishes they could go to EGX. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. I did see the uh, marriage proposal in the new Spider-Man game, Jacob. That was a bit awkward. If you don't know about that, basically some guy requested pro uh, for a proposal to be put in Spider-Man. And then they did do it, but by the time the game released, his, uh, his uh, intended wife-to-be had dumped him for his brother. Ooh, that's a spicy meat bowl. So, yeah, uh, and then it was in the game as a harsh reminder to life's cruelties. So, whoopsie. I might actually be with, be with you all in spirit, Ejex, if Hurricane Florence gets any worse, says Kate Lilly. Bloody hell, Kate Lilly, stay safe, eh? Get down into a, I don't know, a basement. And batten down the hatches or whatever they say. And that is why you don't do public proposals, says Isabella. Indeed. 
Hey, Michael Brigham. Yep, with his brother, Lazy Jane. Even worse. That's really adding insult to injury, that. I don't know. If I do terrible on this game mode again, I might... Uh, I might give it a miss. Because it doesn't seem to be filling up very fast, this game mode. And I don't really need the battle passes anymore. If I was still chasing the battle pass... I would uh, I would give it a go. I still haven't entirely given up the idea of going to EGX, but if I go, it'd be a last minute action, says Asfugle. Well, don't forget to uh, wear your flaming skull helmet that you've just won, Asfugle, if you do. <clears throat> oh man. Yeah, I've got to do. I've got to record a late to the party tomorrow, and do a live stream from Eurogamer HQ. You might have seen from uh, Johnny's Twitter that he's. Um, He's in Rome at the moment. So it's just me and Bendix in the office tomorrow. We're going to be doing a late to the party. I will leave that for you to... Um, what the fuck is going on with my hair? Like a weird shadow causing over my forehead. Um, I didn't do my hair this morning. It's a real mess. I've got bed head, basically. Um... Yeah, it'll just be me and Bendix in the office tomorrow. Uh, we're doing Late to the Party, which I'll keep secret, because it'll be out on Friday anyway. And we're also going to be streaming. And um, I'll tell you for now what we're streaming. We are streaming the new Tomb Raider, which uh, Aoife reviewed for Eurogamer. She wasn't that taken with it. I think she thought it was a bit too doom and gloomy. Uh, I'm sure we'll be able to make it entertaining, though. Um... Bendix and I probably just try and um, try and throw uh, Lara off as many <coughs> as many buildings as we can or something for a lot for the lols. So fire across. Let's let's have a look at the fireworks. Ah, that's nice. Okay, where's... There's lots of them over there. Lots of drops over there. Oh, here comes a guy on a quad bike. I need my own quad bike. Maybe I could nick his quad bike. I think I can nick his quad bike. Yeah, should we try it? It's probably closer than the one I'm... I'm trying to get to. I think he just drove it into this garage. Oh shit, he's driven it out of the garage. Uh, we're going to go get this one then. Well shit, now I can't watch as I've got that game arriving soon, says uh, Vicky Warren. Yeah, there will be spoilers. Of course, um, because we're going to be playing the first 90 minutes of the game. Got him. Nice. That was, uh, that was a beautiful, beautiful bit of fireworking there. And I got myself a quad. So thank you to all 105 people joining me at the moment anyway, when they could be watching the uh, people people stream the new Call of Duty Blackout Battle Royale beta that's just launched. I think this little river's new. I've not seen that little river before. Um, I was thinking about streaming it today, but um, I had to announce this, and also uh, it only launched at 6 and my experience with streaming 
sought after beat as, as soon as they launch is that they normally don't bloody work. So I thought I'd I thought I'd wait for the dust to settle. I might give it a go later. Um I if I do I might like do some streams just, you know, commentary free. Ah, oh, fuck. This is pretty. What a pretty fight. And just stream it straight from my PS4. Ow! He did have one! I didn't think he had one. Oh, I quite like the uh, I quite like the fireworks, but I think I'm gonna go back to playing a normal mode. Drunk wedding stories, please, Ian, says Lazy Jane. Do you know what? I, my wedding was actually um, pretty well behaved. Um, uh, two seconds. Uh, good. Sorry, I'm I'm replying to an urgent EGX email. Uh, what was the time? That what's that? Two thirty till four. Yes, we could do two thirty. Two. We could do that from two thirty to four. If that's easier. Boink. Uh, sorry. As, uh, I'm, I'm sorting out this, this, the streaming schedule. We've got a few things that uh, we're trying to arrange. You know, we're doing quite, we're doing a lot of like re games that have already been released. Uh, we're trying to do a couple of games that haven't been released as well, which is one of the things I was trying to uh, <coughs> sort out there. Right, let's go play and solo. Uh, my, uh, my 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 wife's family stayed in a hotel uh, after the wedding. Uh, lots of people that like I stayed on the farm in a in a big bell tent, and uh, lots of people stayed on the farm. But my wife's family stayed in a hotel that was also having a wedding, and their wedding sounded a lot more eventful because at about two in the morning they heard all this fighting, and they looked out, and there was about twenty wedding guests having a full on brawl uh, outside the hotel. Um, something to do with someone had discovered someone had been uh, cheating on someone else, kicked off a full on brawl. Uh, and they said that they saw the, the the bride in a full full on wedding dress, like proper shove a bridesmaid onto the floor, like that scream effing and blinding. It's crazy. Um, so mine was pretty well behaved, apart from that. Uh, one of one of our guests, who shall remain nameless, got so drunk he was uh, sick on a plate of chips in the marquee. That was uh, that was quite funny. I didn't see that though. Uh, there was lots of people, um, lots of people doing rock band karaoke, which is quite funny. Uh, Bratz was there, and a few other people from Eurogamer playing uh, playing karaoke, rock band karaoke there. Uh, I think it was pretty well behaved. We had a mosh pit. We had a rock band there playing um, quite late, so a bit of a mosh pit. Uh, my friends are dickheads, but they're all really nice, and they don't really, you know. We're not the sort of fighty type, to be honest. At least, you know, not always. Right, I'm, it's, it's a solo match now, right? So I'm dropping with nothing. I need to find myself some weapons. I'm going to head to that building at the end of the runway, just above my head there. If this person doesn't get their first... Yeah, they think they've got their first. Yeah, I was going to say there's normally a bleep bloop up there, and you can see that they've picked that up, but... The weapon for it may have fallen out on the floor. It, I don't know, though. I think it was the first aid kit. It was. Shit. I'm going to die, then. I got your first aid kit. Please don't kill me for it. Up, 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 up. Oh, he's a bad shot. Oh, he was a terrible shot.
Ah, fuck. That guy wasn't, no. That was a completely different one. Uh, at least I got two 200 battle points for that. Uh, two battle pass points there. That's good. Who is Bratis, says Jacob. I don't know. I don't know. Who is Bratis? Who knows? Do, do, do. Oh, Bendix is watching. Hello. What's he been saying? So glad you lot are streaming from EGX. I've cleared my schedule for them, says Nightcat. Nice. Yeah, we've got, I think we've got two streams per day, except for one day. Uh, except for the, yeah. We've got two streams every day, except for on the Friday when Oxbox are doing a stream uh, in one of our slots. So uh, there'll be plenty, plenty of moderation for you to do, I'm sure, Nightcat. <clears throat> do, 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 do. This is what my voice sounds like today, by the way, Bendix. So uh, apologies if uh, <laughs> apologies in advance if I still sound like this for tomorrow's filming. So I'm fine. I I am still very discombobulated. Go meta and cosplay Bratis cosplaying sharp, says Owen Maguire. Did you did we did we ever say that for Bratis is leaving present um everyone club together and gather and got him a replica of Sharp's sword? Uh that was uh, that was pretty good. <clears throat> Thanks, Steve Reeves. He says congrats on getting married. No, Bratis didn't walk me down the aisle, I'm afraid. <laughs> Dusty Leaf says, "No worries, Ian. If anything, you just sound husky and manly. It's a pity I, I look weak and weak and frail, in, though." Close your eyes and imagine me husky and manly. Don't open your eyes and see the uh, the uh, the mess that is uh, the reality. Um, so yeah, we're going to be doing. Um, I don't know how long you've been watching. Uh, Ben Dix, but I was just saying that we're going to be streaming Tomb Raider tomorrow. Ooh, an APC. So, uh... Put my, put my paint job on it. So, uh, I think we need to do a challenge. Who can kill Lara Croft in the most grotesquely gory way? Because if it's anything like all the other games, like... <laughs> she just... Like, I played one, and I slid down a hill, and, uh, she, like, she got, like, a, a a branch, went, like, went through her neck. Now, the other side, then she just lay there again. I was like, holy fuck. That's pretty brutal. So, yeah, I don't know. It'll be good, good fun to try that out. Uh, I've played the other two, so I want to play this one as well. One thing I haven't played yet, um, and I don't think I'm going to get the chance to for a while, probably... Is uh, is Spider Man? I've heard great things about it, but I don't have it. And uh, like I said, it's, it's it's hectic as fook for the next two weeks. So we're gonna be. Um, I I don't think I'm gonna have any time to actually play it. Uh, obviously, the week of EGX platform thirty two streams will be uh, will be non-existent. I just think I I think I just saw a bleep bloop. I did. Because uh, I'm going to be at EGX, but we'll be doubling up on the uh, the streams, two two Eurogamer streams per day. So that'd be good. Maybe, maybe I have to see if I can do it. I might do like a, a Periscope. Does Periscope still exist? Might do some kind of live stream from the community party, maybe if I'm not too drunk. Oh, and uh, I think, think we'll do a um. A live hungover Mario Kart stream on the Sunday after the community party. So uh, I know you lot love the hungover Mario Kart streams, even though we do them like once a year. Well, except everyone except for Bendix will be hungover because for some reason she's impervious to 
alcohol pain. Original Tomb Raider bone snap was a horrible sound. Is it Tomb Raider? Ah, uh, what was it? Tomb Raider, I think, when you hit her head, it made a horror. Maybe it's the bone snap I'm thinking of. The there was uh, Mickey Mouse's Castle of Illusion, I think it was. When he jumped up and hit his head on the rock, it made like a really horrible, like crunch, like hollow skull clong noise. That always made me feel a bit... There may be live vomiting, Space Uppercopter. That is 100% hundred percent likely, actually. I might have to... Uh, come to think of it, I might have to put some buckets by the stage for that one. Yeah, here we go. Bendix says, Con Correction, three people will be hung over and I'll be having a great time laughing at your pain. She's like the Danish Terminator. Mirror's Edge bone snap sound when you fell off a building, says Castaway DC. Everyone's, everyone's sharing their most stomach churning set. There we go. Oxbox, if you're watching, you can buy that idea off me for a list video. X. X most stomach churning sound effects in video games. If you don't buy it, I'll 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 do it. Hello. Wait, what are you, what are you doing, dickhead? Ha ha ha! Oh, da da ding, da da ding, da da ding, ow, da da ding, ding, da da ding, da da ding, ow. Ian, are you okay? Can you tell us? Are you okay? It's the thriller dance, I know, but I couldn't think of the thriller dance in time. <clears throat> They've done that already, I think, says Castaway DC. This is a joke I make with um, with uh, Johnny and Aoife quite a bit. Possibly Bendix hasn't heard it yet, but I say that I have said on many occasions that Oxbox are the Simpsons of YouTube. Because, uh, you know, that South Park thing where they're like, the Simpsons have done it. It's Oxbox are like that with list videos. You think, oh, I know. Let's make a video about the hardest bosses you never knew you had to fight. And then someone will be like, Oxbox have already done it. Fuck. All right. They definitely won't have done a, a, a video about the X most uh, implausible locks on doors. I think you'll find they've already done it in. Oh, fuck! <laughs> so, yeah, oh, so, yeah, they are the uh, the Simpsons of the internet. Yes, Viking jeans, says Dusty Leaves. Oh, God, the noise when you kick people's knees in Assassin's Creed 2, says Dusty. There we go, you see? If they haven't done that video, I think we need to bagsy that video. <laughs> it might have to come with a warning at the start. Warning. This video may make you vomit. Let's just have a look. Here we go, look. I know where all the boxes... I know where all the crates are in this game now. I don't even have to... Don't even have to search for the airdrops anymore. Let's swap the... Uh, swap the scout rifle for the AR. Let's have a little dance. So many helmets. Once, twice, three times a helmet. Oh, I've already got I've already got ten first aid kits. That's good. Uh, all right, we got some drops. These will be blueies dropping, or uh, purples. If you're being pedantic, I like to call them blueies though. Uh, these will be second tier, second tier adventure crates. Oh. Hello. Someone's someone's chasing along behind me. Shall I give them a signal? See if they respond. They may be a friend. Sounds like they're a foe. My petrol's nearly run out in this car. This these cars are super armoured. And much better for squads than they are for solos, to be honest. And the petrol runs out super fast. Ding, 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 meow. Right, be something better than what I've got. Oh. Here we go, All right, better helmet, that's good. First aid kit, uh, KH, that's a better sniper rifle. 
Uh, we've already got that. We get the ammo. So we've got a good sky sniper rifle. We've got the KH-43. So that's got like a two times scope on. So that's good for like mid mid range combat. Uh, that's all right. That was. I think my favourite gun is still the um, still the CQ because it's brilliant for like close to mid range combat. Uh, but the KH is uh, is is rapidly becoming a favourite one of mine. Oh shit! Oh yeah! You are rubbish. You are so rubbish. You are rubbish. I totally beat you. Well, I didn't expect to. Did not expect to live through that. Uh, that was a bit annoying, that, because the icon was still on screen. But he... But the, but the, the he'd already schnaffled the crate. So he got two KHs. Yeah, two KH-43s. So greedy. So what I've got, I've got Marauder. I've got an AK, I've got a KH. Marauder's good for long range. Let's stick with this. What's that ammo? I'll have it. Gas grenade, no space. I've got four frags. I'll take this guy's uh, quad bike. Oh! Let's, let's get on the quad bike before I accelerate this time, shall I? Probably sensible. Uh, is Bendix off? See you later, Bendix. She's probably off to sensibly have a, no uh, have a nice um, early night. Okay, gotta go have fun blowing stuff up. I look forward to blowing up Lara tomorrow over and over again. <laughs> Me too. Me too. Hopefully we can make what seems to be potentially a gloomy game into a, a cheerful, fun time, mischievous shenanigan fest. Let's stand there. There's a, there's a Where's he going? Got one hit on him. Oh! 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 That kicked me out to the menu pretty quickly. Uh, <laughs> that was a, I killed that one guy, but then someone else, um, I think, sniped me from the distance. I was I was too busy jumping around and then insta died and that would kick me right back. That did. Oh. I I don't even I think I got two kills that one. That was that was very quick. Don't I think I can. What have got the icebreaker? What's that? Orange schematic AR rifle. Mm. Golden bandana. Yeah. Sniper military backpack. Nah, I don't like any of them. Don't like any of them. Alright, let's carry on. Stop! Carry on. So, did you just fall down and died? I think potentially I did. I keep missing the loot's message. Everyone thought the Millennium Falcon was your wedding cake. Is that fruit bat? Oh, it definitely wasn't my wedding cake. That was... Uh, so, the story behind that is, in my brother's best man speech, he, uh, he told the story about how when he was about three, he pushed a chair over onto my... Yeah, original Star Wars Millennium Falcon. Uh, and he snapped the turret off the top. <coughs> I still remember being the most gutted. Like, um, oh, I, I very vividly remember it. And trying to get the turret back on and stuff, and it didn't work. Uh, and basically, he told that story, and then he was like, I, you know, 30 odd years, 35 odd years later. Um, I can make it up to you. And then he gave me, uh, he, he'd managed to get an original Millennium Falcon intact um, for me. So that was nice, wasn't it? But no, it wasn't a wedding cake. The wedding cake was from, uh, it was one of, the, ouch, one of those three tiered things. Um, it was like red velvet, vanilla, red velvet icing kind of kind of kind of 
kind of thing. It was nice. <clears throat> it was very nice. In fact, it was so nice that uh, Laura had wedding cake for breakfast. So I guess you can't, you know, got to... You don't get married every day, so you might as well have wedding cake for breakfast at one time. If the Millennium Falcon was the wedding cake, I would not have been able to lift it up like that. I, if I, and if I had it done, I'd have uh, I'd have absolutely wrecked it. Someone's just landed right next to me. Where are you, dickhead? I'll give him a dance to say sorry. Sorry for your time wasted there. Have a dance. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Don't do a little longer. Breakfast just champions. <laughs> Who said that? Oh, fruit bat. It scrolled up just as I was reading it. <clears throat> on the 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 day after the wedding, we all had breakfast on the farm. And that was really nice. Proper like uh, it was proper like full English breakfast. Sausages and bacon. Oh, the bacon! I wish I, I wish I had some more of that bacon right now. It was the nicest bacon. Oh, it was bloody lovely. Um, needed it as well. Didn't really eat that much on my wedding day because of nerves. And then uh, people kept buying me drinks, and then I was pissed. <laughs> this, the, we we had we also well I say we. Laura bought a, like a big kind of. Uh, it was like a sweet stand thing and then loads of pick and mix we had like a pick and mix thing at the wedding next to the food and you could little bags and spoons and stuff you ah, fuck. You make your own pick and mix bags didn't get any of that either that got, all got eaten turn my back one minute the next it all been schnaffled I was terrible at schnaffling it's just nice to see loads of people I haven't seen for a long time. <clears throat> Isn't keeping the top tier a thing? Says Owen Maguire. Uh, if it is, then I've done it wrong because I've kept it in my belly. And the top tier was part of what we were eating. Well, what Laura was eating this morning and what I ate um, for my pudding at lunchtime. Someone... Is there a crate dropping here. Someone right close. Don't know whether to go fight them. I was going to go for a crate. Yeah, that's, that's a... Alright, fuck it. I'm going to go fight him. He's just killed someone. Look. Now he's trying to run away. Thanks. Thanks for Luke, dickhead. Ah, ah, ah. Didn't want that. Ah, 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 ah. Ow! Ah, run away! Tee hee! Where did that crate go? I think someone else has schnaffled it. Damn it. Oh, oh he had 6% health left. Oh, that would have been the best dance ever if I'd have killed him and then done the little dance. Oh, well. Bravely run away, everyone's saying. Oh, nearly leveled up to 38. I think you keep it till the first anniversary, so he says tradition, says Adam F. Not eating a year old cake. That gave me a right indigestions. What's that? What's up? I've got a right for 
Oh, Kenneth Donnelly's got the flu or something. Get well soon, Kenneth Donnelly. I wish I could. Uh, I wish I, I. I wish I could say it's the flu that's that's made me sound and look like this, but it's all uh, it's all self-inflicted. I'm afraid. <clears throat> Sorry. Just checking. Okay, that seems good. That's right. Okay. Lazy Jane is off for food. Alrighty. It's time for food. I'm going to win this one, man. <clears throat> Even Ian's yelp is broken, says Vicky Warren. I'm so weak. I'm so weak. Oh, Kenneth Donnelly says the custom was to save the wedding cake till the first anniversary. Uh, back in the day, wedding cakes were fruit cakes, so they could be kept to mature for a year. Ha! Huh. Yeah, this one, uh, this one's just like a was just like a sponge kind of thing, but like really like deep filled sponge. It's very, it's still, it's it's it was very well made actually. It's still um, considering we got it like. Uh, the day before it was made the, two days before the wedding we picked it up the day before the wedding so it's like four days old now and it's been in the fridge as well a bit what we ate it's still like nice and um, nice and uh, and moist and uh, tasty not stale or anything like that it's, yeah, it's bloody, bloody, bloody good cake which it which should be T tell you what I didn't expect there's a guy in there. Uh, I didn't expect wedding cakes to be so expensive. Oh, bloody hell, yeah. It's a bloody cake. Just a pack of Haribo would have done me. Ah, oh, shit, I'm blind. I see you. I see you. Right there. I see you. I'll see you. I'll get an angle on you. There you are. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, he quit out pretty quick, didn't he? Oh, we had this. We had the scout rifle. There's someone else here now. Let me through. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Such a horrible, terrible troll. <clears throat> he was doing a good job hiding, right, oh, Maguire. Oh, Maguire. Jackie Holmes is sad because he doesn't have cake. And yeah, if the Millennium Falcon had been a cake, that would have been extremely expensive. Yeah, which would have been another reason why I wouldn't have been able to pick it up and uh, zoom it around like I uh, did in that picture. Right, where are we going? I need vehicles. One here somewhere. Here it is. Here it is. Oh, excellent. And we get the Catmobile. Oh, yeah. Beautiful Catmobile. It's a beautiful... Ah. <clears throat> right, where's my where's where's my airborne prezzies? Oh there. Gifts from above. Let's just swing by these buildings and Sure, I can't hear a bleep bleep anymore. What the fuck? I thought I saw those posts there and I thought they were legs. I thought there was someone stood there going, I'm not here. <whistles> thought so. My loot ears were burning. What we got? Uh... It's 
an AK-47. Don't mind if I do. It'll do. Yoink. Got a bag. Got my little flash bag. A little flash sack. Hey, Bruno Asante! Right. I think I've well lost those um, crates now. They're miles away this way. <clears throat> I've got an AK though. AK's pretty good. Has Oxbox done seven best weddings? Yeah. I don't know. Maybe not. I wouldn't I would not be surprised if they had though. Hello. Oh. Whoa, hey, hey! Oi! Oh fuck, wrong gun! This is not good. Oh wrong gun! And then I switched once more to the wrong gun. <laughs> oh for fuck's sake. How the hell did that happen? Ah, oh, that was bullshit. I wonder if you could get a Neko Chun wrap for a car in real life, says Vandal. Oh, maybe. Do, 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 do. Did you hear the writers behind The Last Jedi are working on a sequel to The Last Starfighter? Uh, no, I think it's... I don't think it's the writers behind The Last Jedi, because that's, um, what's his face? Rian Johnson, I think. Uh, it's Gary Witter who wrote, um, Rogue One. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's the Rogue One writer behind Last Starfighter. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Married life has changed you and you used to be good, says Jacob. I mean, Jacob, you've been watching these streams for a little while now. You know that's not true. Six game weddings destined for divorce. I mean, that'll do. That's a good one, that. Sell that one to Xbox. Sex game weddings destined for divorce. I don't know many game weddings. I can't think of any off the top of my head. I think of plenty of married people in games that didn't work out so well. They haven't done best weddings. <clears throat> We down we go. Oh, it's the airfield again. Is there anywhere close, anywhere better to go than the airfield? Oh, I'll go here. I'm not a massive fan of this hillside town. I don't know why. I think it's because it's a pain in the ass to drive around. Looks pretty from above, but when you're trying to drive through the middle of it, it's like fucking ill. Someone, I, I I spotted someone landing at the top of the map. I'll win this one, don't worry. The other one, I was, I was, you know, I was talking about things. I was having my mind was in other places. I can't remember what I was talking about, but I was talking about something. I want to change my helmet as well. This is the helmet I'm wearing at the moment. You can't see the front of it, so there's like no point in me wearing it, really. It's the one you get if you complete all the um, battle passes. It's got like a, a visualizer, like a, an EQ visualizer thing on the front of it. It's kind of like a Daft Punk helmet. It looks pretty cool from the front, but you can't spin the camera around to see your character or anything like that. So it's a 
you know, you can't really admire it very well. Uh, so I want to put my uh, nightmare mask on, my uh, my black unicorn mask on. I do like that one. Got, already got armor. Someone's kicking off up top there. Let's get to see if I can get in a little fight. <clears throat> Kate Lily says, spoiler, Ian will not win this one. Oh, Kate, spoilers! I didn't need to know that. I don't know where that gunfire is coming from. Ah. <laughs> That's again your loot. Poor guy. He's probably in that house having a lovely little loot. Thinking, oh, I'll get in that I'll get in that quad bite once I've had a little schnaffle. And then what happens? Sexy Mr. Higton comes along. Steals all of his shit. What a prick. Need some more armor now though. Ian, is life any different now that you're officially wedded? No. Uh, not really. Well, not at all. In fact, about the same. Still a giant child. Um, except for now I've got loads of thank you cards to write. I'm a giant child with loads of thank you cards to write. Uh, so yeah, no, it's just the same. Just the same. Oh yeah, I do have a ring now, but you know, we'll see how long that stays on. <laughs> uh oh. No, I can't do it because I'm reloading. No, bye bye. Oh, he left. He bloody left. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on. Still haven't got that armour. Mm -hmm. Need a bag. Need a bag. Need some armour. And I could do with uh, finding a, a bleep bleep for some extra weapons. Weapons. Got uh, the AR, which will give me a bit of first first aid. No, I won't. What am I fucking talking about? Give me a bit of um, range. All these spoil sports you don't want to be danced to by Ian. I know, right? That fruit bat. Don't worry. I can hear a bleep bleep here. Uh, I can, uh, I, I, I will dance at you all at EGX. I always do terrible with a combat shotgun, so I'm not 100% sure why I picked it up. There's a bag there. <clears throat> uh, there was armour. There was another, another bit of armour in one of the houses I passed. So, oh, here we, go. here we go, here we go, right, any drops in the sky, no, oh, here comes the planes though, so let's have a look at the map, we're kind of dead centre, so I think we'll get some drops near me, there'll probably be blueies by now as well, drop right on me, drop, 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 bastard, uh, it's not too far away. Uh, it's all right. What's going on here? Laura's entitled to half of Ian's games, says Thomas Green. 
Oh god, yeah, shit. Uh oh. Knew I should have made her sign a prenup. It is indeed a bluey. Uh -huh. Marauder? But I barely even knew her. Lovely armors. I've oh, got loads of goodies in this one. The Soko. Marauder's going to go up there. There's another one over there. Oh, it's just been nicked. Let's see if I can... See if I can do some sniping of them if I'm quick enough. Oh, here we go. Ah, wasn't quick enough. What's that over there? That greeny. Okay, I think I'm being followed by that one dude now. Been shot by two people. Okay, he's dead. Yikes. Fuck, pissed it. <laughs> oh, well, we knew that was going to happen because Kate Lily spoiled it for us. Never mind. Oh, I leveled up, though. Two battle passes there. That's for leveling up. You get like 20 when you reach a, a, a round number. So when I get to 40, I'll get 20 battle pass takers. I won't get anything for them. Shouldn't have got off then, to be honest. I should have just carried on driving, but my... My thinking, not so good. Ian's thinking, not so good. Play again. Do 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 do. <laughs> right, so let's sort this. That game and reviewed it for you again. What's Bruno Asante saying? Ba 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 ba. Well, I've missed a comment somewhere. What's this for? Oh, it's a review for Firewall Zero. Uh, that's bloody great, that game. Bloody great, that game. I haven't been able to play it for a couple of days because of the weddings and stuff, but I need to... I want to get on that again. Luke's got a copy of it, so I need to get him in a, in a stream with it. For sure. Is oop the new helping says Jacob. Only while my voice is uh, is is gone, like this. Thanks, Kenneth Donnelly. Oh, he's asking if I'd stream more Fireball Zero. Yeah, I I can't. Uh, I guess I kind of answered then. I will do. Um, I I don't know when. I've got some crazy like I've like I said I've got oh, I've spawned right next to a person. Uh I've got a few crazy days ahead of me. Wednesday uh I'm doing I'm doing a an, another kind of retro games on retro hardware style stream 
but it's not a retro. It's technically so it's sort of a retro game, sort of not. Basically, I'm playing a game called Tanglewood. It's called Tanglewood, which is like the first game to have been made for the Mega Drive for ages. Um, it's out on Steam now, but you can also go to their website and buy an actual, um, an actual uh, Mega Drive cart for it. I don't have a way to um, attach a Mega Drive to a HDMI cable at the moment, so I'm only going to be able to stream the PS4 version. But I thought that was kind of like a that would be an interesting thing. Feature. What's this fucker that just threw a firebomb at me? There he is. Oi! Oi! Shit, dicks! Ooh, fuck, duck, 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 fuck, duck, duck, duck. Get the fucking bandage! He better still be there. I'm coming to dance in your motherfucking grave. You get the sarcasm and die. Ah, oh, he knew it. He knew it. He knew what was happening. He knew he'd been absolutely schooled by the Hickton. Oh, fuck. Someone else is here now. I do not have the health to deal with another person. They're just outside this wall. They may not have a gun. What have I got? Close range, I've got this. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Did have a gun. Did have a gun. Did have a gun. The operative word. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Shotgun for me. Well... Oh yeah, Mega Drive is uh, the European name for Sega Genesis. If you don't know what a Mega Drive is. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Right. See, I told you that last match when I died, but I wasn't thinking. <gasps> Fuck you! Know, it's another one. Oh yeah. Dancing in your fucking loot. Dancing in your fucking loot. Dancing in your fucking loot. Let's have a little looty shoot. <laughs> right, it's, the, the whole map seems to have fucking spawned on this map. The whole the whole map seems to have spawned in this area. Even hello, Ian Walsh. How are you doing? Married life is clearly matured. Ian says Ian Walsh. Mm. Nope. I need some armor. R.I.P. to all fellow headphone users. I'm sorry. Did I do a did I do a loud shout then? <clears throat> I can't tell with these headphones on sometimes. They're excellent at noise cancelling. These uh, Hyper X12s, whatever the fuck they're called. Everyone spawned here, and they didn't know to go to the secret hospital crate. Idiots. Idiots. 
tell you what. It's a bloody good job I'm here. Right, you can go there, you can go there. She, uh... Oh, the gas is coming. Oh, no. Oh, shit. I wasn't paying attention. Where's the vehicle? There's one here, supposedly. Here it is. Have I got to go far? Oh, shit, I do. Better get out of here. <clears throat> Let's follow this line. I was going to read some comments as I drove, but... I think I better get out of the choking gas cloud as quick as I can. Oh, yeah. Four kills so far, it's not bad. Should have won, uh, should have clipped that. Could have won myself a deluxe founders pack with some of these gameplay skills. No, I'm so. Alright. Oh, there's someone right there. Don't shoot me. Oi! You colossal ring piece. Where, have you, where is he? Where is he? Where is he? There he is. He's in the gas. So that can't be helping him too much. Oh! Still in the gas. I mean, there he is. Still, <laughs> still running around in the gas. I can see you. I need to get back to my car. Oh, this is a bad idea. Ah, pump. I'm just going to go back to my car. Fuck it. He may die in the gas. He couldn't have... He must have taken some damage. <clears throat> I hope no one took my quad. Oh, I thought someone took my quad then. What I'll do is I'll go around here and see if I can offer him a lift. He's probably going to shoot at me. If I see him. If I was him, I'd be heading towards a car that's around here somewhere. Which is this quad bike. So what I'm going to do. I'm going to tuck that one there. I'm going to drive off on this one. Beeping the horn. Ha ha! You might not know the other one's there. It's going to be so sad. It's going to be like, no. Right. Pretty, uh, pretty injured. Okay, I don't have... I don't have very much health. I don't have very much armour. So... And the, these drops are not going to drop in the danger zone. They're going to drop in the safe zone. <clears throat> so I am uh, probably not... Ah! 
I'm probably not going to get to them before someone else does. Or before there's a big crowd blown because they're the yellows. Goddamn yellow crates! Hey, Sol Reed, how's it going? Wee! Boo! Mwah! Meep meep! Now I gotta think, I gotta try, I gotta. I say I've gotta be sensible here, but. How sensible can one Ian be? The answer is not very. Two Ians are a lot more sensible. One Ian. I got a chance. Boop! Ow! Fucker. Got no armor, so that gave me bleed damage. Hey! Hello? There's a guy right there. Whiteys! I mean, getting this, getting this crate's not going to happen, is it? Ooh, no, I don't want to go near him. I need to try and be a little bit more sensible now, I guess, if I'm trying to play the the winning game. I'm trying to play a game of Winsy Maroos. Winnie McPhee's. Let's let this guy do the work. Let's let this guy do the work. There's someone behind me. people everywhere look watching that crate okay new plan well someone's opened that crate new plan drive really fast past it see if they've dropped any health that I can schnaffle oh look at this yoink yoink Great plan. Put work perfectly there. That's all I needed, that really. Armour and. and a hot nut. Get the fuck out of here. Uh, now I need someone nice to hide. 17 people left. I've got full level 2 armour. Full level 2 helmet. A marauder, which isn't too bad. Get off, get off, get off! Up! Up! What the fuck was that? Okay, so safe zone is that direction. the guy who shot at me. Keep he might be hiding in one of those maybe the house I parked outside. Can I see the person on that hill that's sniping? Someone up here sniping. Injured him quite a bit. Need to get out of the gas there because it's going to chunk. Oh, it's chunking me two per second. Oh, fuck, this is really hurting. First aid kit.
Hmm. Not a great deal of places to hide in this new zone. Let's stay with the edge of the gas for now. Hello, this guy's cutting it fine. Oh, he's out in the he's out in the gas. Look. Stay on the edge of the gas. Oh, everyone's on vehicles. Hello. Alright, so this is the safe zone. Oh, he died. Who shot him? Fuck. Oh, nothing to do with you. Not until I know. Not until I know what kind of. What, I, what I'm dealing with. There's some. A lot of shooting around here. Oh, this. Okay, there's a. There's this guy in the gas back here, yep. Yeah. Got him. Didn't take many hits either. Just going to see what guns he had. He might have had something nice. He's got a nice little hidey hole, actually. Level 2 helmet. Uh, oh, is that C and Q? Might take the C and Q for close range. Okay, guess is pushing. Stay behind this lip here for as long as I can. Oh, it looks like that police. What? Tick, 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 tick. Where was that fire? Where was it from? In the gas, it was. That guy from the gas. Oh, this, this chap here. Well, uh, a lot of camouflage, you tool. Shut. Everyone's moving a bit. This is why I really need one of those, uh, one of those lovely um, air raid things. Okay, he's got. Hmm. Thinking, 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 thinking. There's really no cover. Well, there is cover, but the person who has it... Well, someone's already got it, basically. What I'm going to have to do... I need to get... I need to put some health on soon. Maybe if I drive into the smoke... Put, oh, my health is already full. Ah, damn it. I was going to try and, try and like, boost my health against the gas. Because the gas is going to push in now. It's five left. I'm going to stay on this... Ooh, am I? Okay, I was going to stay on the quad bike for as long as I could. Change my mind to get that kill. Uh, there's two mistakes I made there. One was not reloading my gun. And the other was... Not putting health on. That little tree douche is still alive. Fuck. Right. Got you. Lie down. Health. Health, 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 health. Fuck. I don't know how I did that, but I won it! Yeah! There we go. Unlocked a victory crate. Boop boops! There we go. Oh, told you I'd win one. Right. Uh, exit match. Well, oh my god, he did it, says Isabella. Tee <clears throat> Oh, fair play. Well, I'll open that victory crate and then I think I'm going to go have a fucking lie down. Oh, 
Oh, that's not going up. Mm -mm -mm, customize. Kratz. Victor Kratz. What have I got? What have I got? The rune work boots. Meh. Not very, not very exciting. There we go. I win with seven kills. Alrighty. So, I'm off. Oh, before I have a lie down, uh, I'm going to go and... Uh, uh, I've got to send out those codes, haven't I, to uh, to the people who won. So, if you don't, or if you were one of the winners and you don't already follow at Platform Thirty Two on uh, Twitter, then um, go do that now because uh, I'm about to DM you. So, uh, your first win is a married man. That's true, Anthony Colleen. That's true. So, uh, yeah, wicked. Thank you very much, everybody, for watching me instead of uh, Call of Duty Battle Royale. It's been a pleasure. Hope you had a lovely stream. I did. I uh, have a lovely, little bit of a wobbly start because I'm really confused and hungover still. But I think, you know, I think I, I think I, uh, I think I did all right in the end, huh? Hold on. I just want to... What the hell are these? What, what, what are these shoes? Seraph boots. Oh, they must be from the Guardian Angel thingy. They're, they're from uh, uh, the Guardian Crate. I, I, they must be. But yeah, anyway, thank you very much, everybody, for watching. If you did enjoy this stream and you haven't done already, do give it a like, do subscribe, and do have a very lovely day. Thank you very much to all, to all the moderators and sponsors, or members as they're now called, to uh, for uh, coming along and helping with the stream funsies. And... Uh, do have a lovely day. And to all the winners, congratulations. Enjoy your codes. Bye.